Good morning. I've lost my glasses. That seems to be a reoccurring theme during my pregnancy. I lose my glasses and my phone constantly. Like, I'm always kind of bad about losing my phone, but like the glasses thing, it's ridiculous. So I think I'm going to pack them soon in my hospital bag and just use my old prescription ones so that I have them and I don't have to search for them when I go into labor and have them already in the bag. <laughs> so it's Saturday and we are going to probably clean today, get um, the dog's Easter pictures done because they do pictures every single year. I do pictures of them since Ralph was little. Um, I could never get our Chihuahua. She was 20 and old and she didn't like playing or doing anything. She just liked to sleep. She liked to sleep and eat and sometimes cuddle. Like she's very particular in her old age. And um, when we got Amber, I could never get a picture of them together easily because Chalupa just, she didn't really want to do pictures. When I had done some like pictures of her, she would, she only liked to do it by herself. She was just a grumpy old lady. So when, after she passed away, I would take pictures of Amber, cute pictures of Amber by herself too, like I would do with Chalupa, just individual ones. But when we got Ralph, the very first Easter, he was so little. I was like, will he fit in an Easter basket? And even though he wouldn't fit in the Easter basket, we still got this really cute picture. And then it kind of took off taking pictures of them every Easter. And the Easter after that was probably the best one. And then last Easter's wasn't the best Easter picture. Um, it's like, yeah, it was, I wasn't very pleased with it. I feel like I could do better, especially after the Easter before that. So we decided that we were going to buy a new camera, like a DSLR or whatever, like a good one. We wanted it for the hospital and we wanted it for when Jackson came home because we were looking at newborn picture photos. And I understand, I totally can understand people are photographers and, um, you know, I made cakes and sometimes people don't understand why a wedding cake would cost six to seven hundred dollars or more. Or like if you wanted a 3D cake that looked like your dog, it was going to cost more than $100. You know what I'm saying? So I get that there is, it is somebody's livelihood and stuff. But I can't afford to spend $300 on newborn pictures and every time he needs pictures done, have a, like that much. We, not, we, we don't get a lot of professional pictures done. Um, I'm really pretty good with a camera. I did photos of my Chihuahua like back back before people used like Photoshop and all that stuff and, and people still used film cameras and everyone thought I had got them professionally done and I've always just I've been really good with the camera like it's totally different being a photographer it's its own thing I'm not saying I could be a photographer I would never say that but I feel confident enough to do some newborn photos of Jackson myself and take his photos throughout his life myself because I just, it's crazy to me to be constantly spending hundreds of dollars on professional photos when really, like, really honestly, truly, my friends that get professional baby photos done and all that stuff, they have them out for a while, you have it captured forever, but you really only ever have one or two of them that stay out or, you know what I mean? So it's just like, it's, we're very... <sighs> conscious of how much money we spend so it was like for like one and a half sessions of some of these people I was looking at to do newborns or a family or stuff I could go buy a nice camera which I can also use on YouTube if I want to do higher quality videos because it also does really high quality videos and it comes with a good lens so I mean it's good for starting out we'll just say that Hey guys, we're out running errands and um, we went to go get my new camera and I usually stay out of stuff in stores and mind my own business. <laughs> like even when it's cr like, I guess it, like, okay, like when, when we went to register and like when Crystal and I, every time we go and we look at stuff and babies are us and stuff, there's all these women that just walk up to you and they're like, that's a horrible this or that. And it's like, I was just 
did I ask you to talk to me? So talk I can't me. stand when people do that or get involved. Like I, 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 it's like a pet peeve. I, and I never do it like ever, but there is this poor guy in Best Buy. He's buying the exact same camera I film with. And apparently he was just buying it. Who he told us later just to film his baby. He's having a baby. And it was the exact same camera I filmed with, and he was, um, he just asked the guy to get it out that worked there. And the guy that worked there was like, yeah, okay. And when he came back there, he was like, do you guys need help? He's like, I need this camera. And I said, I need a camera too. And I was like, but you can get his first and just come back to me. So, and the guy goes, do you recommend, like, I don't know what kind of SD card I need. So I was like, whatever, just minding my own business. He goes over there, you know, I was, even though it's the same camera I have, I wasn't like, oh, let me recommend you the one I have, you know? So, I'm, but I'm standing there and he's like pulling SD cards that don't even fit in the camera and suggesting to him. And then he's trying to sell him a $99 SD card that doesn't, his camera doesn't even do with SD card. Like it, it, it doesn't like, it would have made no sense because the camera can't do everything the SD card does. And so I, I wandered over to Justin who is picking an SD card for our new camera. And I was like, are you listening to this? That's my camera. And he's like, I was like, he's trying to sell him a completely wrong one and a $99 one. And his friend Josh works at Best Buy. And I was like, do they make commission or something? Like, why is he trying to sell him this card he doesn't need that's so overpriced? And um, I, he was like, no, I don't think so. Come to find out, they don't make commission, but they have what, sales? They track sales. They track sales and they get like what, bonuses yes. or something? Like you get a gold star and a bonus. I don't freaking know. Josh told us this. That's because that's we're going to get to why in a second. So <laughs> um, I can't take it anymore because he's selling him, first off, the completely wrong kind of card, okay, for the camera. And then he's trying to sell him a $99 one. And he, st he stepped back because the guy was like, I just need a second. Because I think he could tell this guy didn't know what he was doing. So finally, I look at Justin. Justin looks at me and we get involved, <laughs> which we never do. Like, we never do. We always just mind our own business. But I was like, I have, I, I started off by being like, I have that same camera. I just, I was like, it's a good camera. I just left it at that and let him lead. He was like, is it? Blah, blah, blah. And I was like, you know, you don't need a $100 SD card. I just kind of like let him ask what we would suggest and then so we ended up finding him an SD card that was way better priced and then too the guy said he needed eight hours on the camera and I was like are you buying an extra battery he's like no I'm like you don't need eight hours then because your camera's only gonna run for three so you don't really need an eight hour card be unless you just you know never want to change out the card but uh, really, if you want to save money, so is he ended up like listening to us and buying the card we suggested. And the guy that worked there was so freaking pissed because the card he ended up getting was like what twenty eight bucks? No, it was twenty five. Twenty five bucks versus the hundred dollar card that wouldn't even work in the camera he was trying to sell him. <laughs> he was so freaking mad about it. And so when he left, I was like, "What is the problem? He doesn't make a commission." And then he went. He never came back to help get my camera out, which is funny because the guy was was only buying like a hundred and eighty dollar camera. We were buying like a four hundred something dollar camera. So he texted his friend. He's like, "What's the deal? I thought y'all don't make commission." And then he said about like the bonuses and the sales quota stuff. And I'm like, "Well, that was still stupid because he never came back. He got pissed off and left, and he never came back." And I was like, "That is so dumb because he just missed out on like an almost five hundred dollar sale then." Like, after we bought our SD card and stuff. I was like, well, your little temper tantrum just wasted you even more money. Like, it was so ridiculous. Anyways, we got my camera. And um, it's funny because it's the location his friend works at. And he was like, I know exactly who you're talking about. And he knows nothing about that stuff. Like, he never even remembers to suggest SD cards to people. Anyways, so then we went to Ulta. And I wanted to show you guys. I got, um... I got the Honest Beauty makeup to try. I'm gonna do a review on it, but I'm gonna wear it tomorrow and see how it goes. I made sure, I went to Ulta because you can return stuff if you're not happy with it. And they gave me free wipes, was my gift from Honest, which was on my list to pack in my hospital bag. So I came to the car like, <laughs> Justin, he's like, what are you happy about? I'm like, I got something for free for my hospital bag. 
And they give me a free plasticky like makeup bag. Anyways, so that made my day much better. We're home. We got my push present. That's it for. <laughs> Justin bought it for me, technically. So we're just calling it my push present. <laughs> Even if I end up in a seaside. I It's funny because I always thought that was so ridiculous that people do that, though. Like that's a thing, but they've been doing it since like the a long time because my dad always got my mom a push present. He would always get her a diamond ring, um, like when like she had me and my brother. My sister's my half sister, so um, the only reason I didn't say when she had my sister too is because she didn't physically have my sister. She just raised her. But um, my dad always gave my mom a diamond ring. I get a fancy new camera. Same thing, right? Yes. Seems like it has more use. <laughs> Was he eating out of it? Amber's the only one that's listening. Amber, you're so good. Oh, you're so good. I know. I know. You you, that, you were very patient. Here. You can have another cookie. Where? Come here. <laughs> sit. 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 Hey. Good. Sit. 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 <laughs> sit. 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 Stay. Oh, show Amber in the basket. Wait, wait, wait. Stay, stay, stay. <laughs> stay. stay. Can you adjust the... Get a cookie. <laughs> you guys have neighbors that do shit on purpose and you just know they're doing shit on purpose? Like being nosy and finding things to do outside to see what you're doing? We're just going to leave that at that. Um, it kind of sucks because <sighs> I swear it was almost like they were trying to distract him. With it. It, and as soon as we came in. They went in. Justin and I were like, God damn, really? <laughs> like, so every picture Ralph is like, and we we could barely, he did really good though, because Amber's good. She'll sit through, like she's so well-trained. Ralph, he had a really difficult time and every picture he's like this when he wasn't running away. But it, you know, it is what it is. So we'll just use what we have. Um. So this is the new camera that we just used. Um, it's, 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 from what I see on the screen, it looks really good. Um, and I just used auto because this is the first time using this. We literally unboxed it, charged the battery, and went straight out there. Here you can take it just so they don't knock it over. Um, we Yeah, we literally just charged and took it straight out. I didn't have time to mess with it because of like the I wanted to get decent lighting. So, yeah, hopefully by next year, I'll be a lot better at that. I do better shooting indoors with um, lighting, either natural lighting or um, my lighting. So, I'm going to try to do his newborn pictures myself with my studio equipment. But, for just a quick little snap for an Easter picture, it was way better. Because last year, part of the issue is we had to use my phone and it just picked up colors different in your phone pictures versus like a good quality camera picture is so quality camera picture is so different like i was not happy with last year's at all so i'm i guess i'll mess with those on the computer i'm in the vlog for today i know that for today for you guys even though it's saturday everyone's like posting Easter pictures and like Easter egg hunting. I'm like, but it's not Easter. I'm one of those people that's like, it's not the actual holiday. <laughs> but I wanted to tell you guys happy Easter because when you're seeing this, it is Easter. Um, I hope you had a nice Easter weekend and we will see you guys tomorrow for real Easter. We're going to church and we're going to one of our favorite restaurants. Um, is that all we're doing tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so... Happy Easter to you guys because I know it's Easter today and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Bye.